Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another horrible, ugly ass day in the world of Let's Build Medieval Town. Um, I've been kind of doing like a little vanilla spree, and that's because Attack of the B Team wasn't working for a while. But now it's back up and running, but I just don't have any ideas to do. Um, so I'll get working on some episodes of that, some modded stuff for you guys, but for now, we're just gonna be doing. Uh, some vanilla stuff because I've just gotten a kick out of it lately, but Yeah, let me uh, let me go ahead and change this to nice weather weather clear there we go and You might know some changes in the world if you've been following the let's build series And that is that there is a zombie up there or a skeleton or whatever. I think it's a zombie um, I've just finished up doing this a couple minutes ago I basically just blasted out a big hole right here, and let me sh let me uh, get my blocks out and let me show you what it looked like before I added this this element. So, right, take out that waterfall. It's just kind of like there, but it's kind of like boring looking, right? And then I I went ahead and added that that top waterfall, and you can go ahead and see inside it. Hi, um, you're gonna d disappear right now. Um, it's kind of just a blast out hole with water falling from the ceiling and bushes hanging and everything, which, uh, I think looks really cool. And then I added this right in front, and I think that just completo it. And, uh, it's going to flow down into a river that, okay, so the river is going to, like, cut down through here. We're going to have a bridge of some sort go up here it's gonna be like a kind of weird bridge I might have to get rid of that tree and put it somewhere else but um, maybe like down here ish and just make it really tall and like hang over this uh, house but it's gonna have to be like this weird upwards diagonal bridge but I think it'll work out and look pretty cool uh, I just needed some sort of river in here so it's gonna cut down all the way through here and flow out right here I'll make like a dam going right across here so hi rotten flesh you're mine now um I don't know if I've showed this or not, but this was, uh, I don't know if this is completed or not, but yeah, yeah, it's all completed, um, so I've got, like, a clothesline, this, like, clothes hamper thing, I thought that was cool little details, um, yeah, I think I've shown all this in the last episode, but today what we're gonna do is, um, I just, I did this off camera because I wanted to make room for the other thing I wanted to do today, um, so obviously... You can see what's in my inventory. Wooden axe. We've got world edit back, so I can uh, I can let's see. Um, I can make this and then uh, and then that, and then say set grass and uh, ruin the whole thing. But obviously, I'm not gonna do that and just press undo, and that happens. So, um, but yeah, that's that's been a lot of good help for this I've been trying to figure out how to copy and paste and like switch and rotate things but I can't I I can't like get this to get put over here so I'm gonna have to like manually build it again which is gonna suck but another thing I wanted to do on camera today was uh, build this custom tree so let's go ahead and do that right now it's gonna be a quick one it's kinda smaller so we're gonna go ahead and do the same thing as we did last time and that is just uh, do this like four or three outwards I mean from the middle and then just do that on all the things and then you can see on this uh, this one this ended at two points so it's kinda gotten this fatter um, cross shape but after you do that what you're gonna wanna do is just like make like a, a dome going up to the top and I'll go ahead and do this for this one on camera this is going to be kind of a more tutorial. I'm sorry that I didn't do the, uh, the, um, block, the, uh, the trunk itself on camera, but obviously you can see that it's really just, it's a kind of a skill that can't really be taught. Um, you just have to kind of place them upwards. I kind of did it at a slant because I wanted it to, like, hang over the edge a little bit. And then the branches are just, like, funky you can't you can't really get branches right unless I don't know they're just kind of weird and funkalicious but obviously that doesn't really matter because the bushes are going to be hanging over it anyway so you kind of just want to do that with it and then 
kind of make like a full dome like that and then I'll I'll go ahead and do that on all the other things all right so I did that and you can already see it's kind of almost coming together already like if you look from the bottom yeah I'm just kidding uh, and I turned on fast graphics so that you can see it you can see the leaves a bit better because I was like having seizures looking at this thing I think I'm gonna take off my glasses real quick so oh oh Mm, after effects of having glasses on for a while when you take them off you get a freaking seizure and you get nauseous and it's just awfulness but yeah in case you didn't know that i have glasses and i just got some new ones the other day and uh they're fossil uh they don't have like a model name or anything i don't think glasses really do that but they're they're like a lot uh taller than my last pair which was which is awesome um so now what I'm doing is just kind of like filling it out a bit more and so it's not just a, a shape. Um, so I'm just kind of like bushify it a little bit and I'll see you guys in a second mundo. Alright, so now you've got these like pod type things and I kind of forgot about this one. Um, and you kind of just have to spam it really. Um, that's all there is to it for uh, as far as the leaves go. But yeah, um, I'm, I kind of want them to look like a... Like one of those acacia trees where it's just like kind of flat, but I still want it to be full like uh, like that one over there. That's kind of like a large scale. That's uh, not as, this one's definitely not as big as that one would be. Because um, it's kind of like a different tree type. But um, there's definitely like a lot of similarities to it. Like I started out both the same. Um, obviously I did that one mostly on camera, like the uh, the big one over there. And now what I'm kind of doing is just like trailing down the bushes, um, down the, down the, um, the, what do you call, branches. And that, that just kind of makes it, um, like a template for when I kind of go in more, more full, fuller, um, on, on this part. So you can already see that when I pull away in a second here, that that's going to start looking a bit more green and full. And now what I'm going to do is I'm kind of experimenting a little bit with these trees. Um, I think what I'm going to do, I mean, I'm going to hang these down like that. And then I'm going to like drape these over the, um, and this make them like crawl down the, uh, this, um, this trunk. So yeah, this is looking pretty cool. I didn't want it to be a, like super full, like I said, um, like the, like the other tree. So this is what I'm gonna do and I'll be back with you guys in a second all right and I think that's thing a on our list for today's episode Dunzo um so I know that uh, let me talk about something real quick I need a bush right there um, let me talk about something real quick I know that this as as a new subscriber you might not be as attracted to this let's build series as some people are depending on like your tastes because it's more of like a watch me instead of like a watch me build this for half an hour and only get this little bit done it's more of like a if you know the youtuber mumbo jumbo or exuma on the hermitcraft server it's more of like i'm gonna skip this i'm gonna skip the footage of this in the interest of getting the most things done in today's episode um so um I personally, and I'm kind of going to sound like a hypocrite when I say this, but um, I actually prefer when people actually do, just do everything on camera. But when you see it as a YouTuber's perspective, and let me start, um, let me start building up this thing. So I'm going to grab my uh, stone bricks real quick. When you see it from a YouTuber's perspe perspective, perspective, then it's you kind of see why the more get stuff done approach is better um it's just because like i'd rather crack on with this series and just be done with it in the shorter amount of time than waste like half a year on this huge ass city and just like you know you know what i mean so that's the only reason that I that I do that that style of let's build I think you would call it um, is in the interest of getting stuff done um, so what we're gonna be working on mostly in this episode is I'm gonna I'm gonna do that one that house 
and that house way over there off camera but what I kind of wanted is I felt like the mountainside was just too bare um we could have like reinforcements in in it and whatever like with uh walls and fences and whatnot but I think to decorate it a bit better would be to do like these big mountain houses um which I think look really cool by the way uh, which I think will, will look really cool, actually, I should say, because I have no idea what they're going to look like yet. But I have a pretty good picture in my mind of what I want them to look like. And this one's going to kind of have like a this kind of roof, like a outward slant type Viking thing, which I'm not sh quite sure how to do. But I don't think I'm going to have the, spru the stone brick trim on it, which I, I think is going to look really cool. Uh, I think for the next layer, I'm just kind of going to lay it out for you right now, is going to be oak wood, yeah, let's go ahead, let's go ahead and do that, um, and I just thought it would have, it would be really cool to have a couple houses up here that have like a really cool view of the whole city, so we could have like a balcony or like a deck coming out right here, instead of, um, just okay, like another Okay, sorry wall, about that, you know? I just got, um, I had to like take my dog and whatever, but. Uh, I just got a pretty good idea from staring back at this, and I'm going to grab my spruce wood stairs, and this is how we're going to close off right there. So, I think we might have fences under the, under the oak wood, but we definitely need, whoop, oh, that's not right, that needs to be set back one, so it's only going to have that, but... Um, we definitely need some oak wood stairs to fill out those windows. And I'm, I apologize if I just, like, completely lost whatever I was talking about before the cut. Okay, so, I'm back for real this time. Um, so we can just do that, I think. And I, I'm going to get rid of this real quick. Or did I need to do that? Uh, yeah, I might as well. Um, so we can do that. And then what we can do is like something like that. I want it to be very wood because, well, actually, not in this case. I think we're going to use cobblestone stairs right there. Um, let me explain the reason I haven't been making so many videos the past like week or so. Is because I had to, well, I didn't have to. I, I Obviously, I wanted to. Um, but Junior Lifeguards is usually a big part of my summer. Um at the end of like August, well not at the end of August, like at the end of summer in August, um, I always, um, do that, it's, if you don't know what it is, it's basically a program for, I think, yeah, I'm probably wrong, but I'm pretty sure that Orange County, or just California in general, is the only, um, place in the world that does this sort of thing, well, I'm, I, I, it, correct me if I'm wrong but I have no freaking idea um but basically it's a program to um it's like a fun slash fitness program where you can just like have fun with your friends and like uh like just do like beach things like capture the flag and and whatnot um stone stair right there yeah stone stair right there um I don't want this house to be too big because it would probably fall down and go boom if it was too big. Um, but I like, like, it, you have to keep it realistic. Like, that's why I did all these, like, foundations going into the, the, the mountainside and whatever. But, um, back to my point. Um, that's why I haven't been making so many videos the past couple weeks. Um, well, just one week, actually. I think I made my last video the speed drawing of the Halo guy, uh, Noble Six. And that, um... That's actually going to be all of Noble Team, just uh, just so you know. Um, if you don't know what I'm talking about, then go ahead and watch my last speed drawing video. And if you don't still have no idea what I'm talking about, then that's just a uh, Halo character from the... Uh, or a Halo set of characters that I'm going to be drawing over the next month or so. Um, taking a little break from drawing stuff for other people, because uh, the last, like, probably five things I've drawn has been like gifts for others um let me see the anime girl was for my mom the Eiffel Tower was for my grandma the Aston Martin was for my dad which I didn't make a video on uh but that that was for my dad um I, I tweeted it so if you don't follow me on Twitter 
go ahead and do so. You'll just get like automatic updates about me and what videos I posted. Um, let's see. Put something right there, right, right there, and um, like something like that. Um, this is gonna be like a deck. Um, so I don't really need to do that much about it right now because I don't even know where the floor level is gonna be at this point. So. Um, I'm just gonna leave the deck alone and just do the walls for now. So, um, let me uh, let me get some stone brick stairs unless I already have them somewhere. Um, but yeah. Um, so I've kind of taken a break of doing other like drawings that I don't really want to do, but I kind of have to do because you know my mom like made me and like my mom's mom made my mom and then she made me so kind of have to do stuff for other people and then my my dad obviously like did the whole thing you know i don't really need to go into detail in this do i um but yeah i just i just felt like i i've never really drawn stuff for other people because like the, the past couple of years is like when i've started to actually take off in drawing and i think that needs to be fences because like i said i want the wood look um but yeah, like the past couple of years is when I really peaked in drawing and, um, not peaked, but like growed, growed, grown. Um, and like now people are starting to like actually want things drawn by me, which is like insane, like full artist right here. Um, I actually don't want to be an artist as my like full time job when I grow up because obviously I know that's like really unrealistic anyways, but if, even if I was, then I still, I'm just not attracted to art enough to do it like eight hours a day, you know, like an animator or something. I used to really want to be an animator, um, but then I kind of got other interests and I just decided art wasn't going to be a thing that I wanted to do like eight hours a day, all day, every single day. Um, cause obviously I still only put up a speed drawing video like once a week, so, um, what was I talking about? Yeah, I want to be an architect, and you're going to think I'm a huge Minecraft nerd for that, but that's actually not the reason I want to be an architect. I just, I find designing and building and creating things cool. I don't want to be, like, the actual guy who, like, does all the the wood and, like, placing and foundations and crap. I just want to, um, what am I doing? Um, I think I want a little slit window right here, so, like, something like this. Yeah, that looks, that looks fine. Um... I want. I just want to like do like the blueprints and the plans for it, and like do concept arts. Uh, yeah, that's uh, well, that's still an art job, I guess. Um, now that I think about it, um, but obviously that's way far ahead in the future. I don't really need to be thinking about that right now. Um, let's put some. St nope, that's the wrong place. Put that right there. Um, that's way far in the future. I don't really need to be thinking about that right now. I don't need to bother myself with it. Um, but oh, that's not gonna work out. I'm gonna have to use. Yep, yeah, whatever. More foundation type stuff. Um, let me put that right there. Um, I just want to, like, make this as realistic as possible, you know? Um, let me put fences right here. Um, and I just started thinking about this, but, um, my sister of 22 has just moved to Alaska with her husband, um, and she... She loves. She freaking loves it. I never thought that living in Alaska would be so cool, but um, I've seen like her Instagram pictures and whatever. But it's it actually looks like really fun to live there. Believe it or not, um, it's not like unbearably freezing because you know you've got like coats and whatever, so you don't even feel it. And after a while, you just get used to it, obviously. Um, but yeah, that's like crazy that. Alaska is like actually cool to live in obviously it's like an amazing place and whatever I've never been personally but um it looks pretty cool uh to like visit and whatever but I'm really excited to like actually go and visit them um maybe this well probably not this summer but like during spring break maybe or maybe like Christmas break but that would probably be too cold huh um but whatever um let me uh let me kind of do some more work on this. I'm thinking I'm going to get the roof laid out on my own. And then I'll go ahead and come back to you guys in a second Monday. Okay, so I think I've got the way I want the roof to kind of flow. And um, 
reach my eye real quick. And I think that I'm just going to go ahead and kind of cave out the inside. Obviously with world edit because I'm not a weirdo anymore. I've got world edit. Um, it's going to be kind of difficult because it's like slanted like this. But let's just start it right here and then go right there for a start. So Sorry about that. Another interruption. My uh, recording cut out. So that was great. Um, I don't know if I've done any work since the last uh, that little automatic. Well, not automatic, but um, like abrupt cut. That's the word. Uh, but I was saying I'm just going to do go ahead and do the rest off camera. And then I'll probably time lapse the rest of these houses if I have the time. Uh, I want to get this video uploaded tomorrow before I go to my dad's house in the morning at like 10 o'clock or whatever. So it's uh it's 10:30 right now at night. So I've got 12 hours to finish this video, which I think will be enough. I'm not sure, but I think it will. All right. So not that much time has passed, obviously, but my question is, is it too simple? Um. Cause like from a distance here, I'm um I'm just outside our little church tower lookout thing with like the strand of lights and whatever. Um, I'm on like a bridge above it, so next to this uh, house as well. So um, once you get far enough away from it, which most views will be, unless you're up here. It's 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 just blocks. There's really like not even any stairs in the whole thing or like fences or walls or anything, but I think it's cool just to have just to be simple um for once in my life. Uh this cuz like all the other uh, let me just see what that looks like. Yeah. No. No. We need like a big sprawling view of the thing. And this is like still even very restricting for what I wanted um but, you know, whatever. Um, so, like, I really like it. And it's kind of nice just to have something simple. And it's going to be kind of like a different style because it's diagonal, you know. Um, not many houses in Minecraft are, or not many of anything in, in, any, in Minecraft are diagonal. So, um, we're going to be a cool kid and not diagonalize. So, um... Let me uh let me do the roof and that'll well let's go ahead and do the roof on camera. Why not? And um so it's gonna be kinda like slanting um away from the top. Uh can I place a place a stair correct, will ya? Okay, so it's gonna be kinda like slanting away from the top gradually. So let me put something there. Yeah. It's gonna be kinda thick. But that's all right with me. Um, is it though? No. No, let's not have that. Those two things cannot be. Um, let me get a spruce wood slab. Uh, let's get rid of the wand for a while. For now. Um, yeah, that's still too weird looking. Let me uh, let me see what happens if I place a stair like like this. What does that look like? Yeah, that's a bit better, and then you can see more of the inside. You guys have no idea what I'm aiming, what I'm aiming for, so don't you try to critique, 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 critique me, um, because I know what I'm aiming for on this, and it's something very good. So I'm gonna do it on this side first, and then I'll do the rest off camera. So, um, sorry for so much off camera, but. I'm just very tired from the junior guards thing. It's uh just running and swimming so far in every which direction way and it's just gets tiring. So forgive me if I'm a little bit of lackluster commentator right now. Um I think I might have like a like a little peek out hole, you know? Let's uh let's see. Can I do that? Yeah, that'll be cool. I and mean, we can do it in stone bricks, actually. And that'll look better. So, like... Oh, come on. Let's place one right there and like that. And this is going to look kind of weird, but it's going to just add... Always do, like, these little nook lookout things in your roofs if they look too flat or, like, boring. So, it looks like it's just continuing up from there. And then you get, like, a nice little piece of detail in the roof. And it might be too low... I might, yeah, let's raise it up a level, um, 
So like, I think we can do it out of wool now. So let's do something like this. Whoops. And something like, like this, I think. I'm not sure. Does that look, does that look good? I don't know. Let me, uh, let me do one quick, uh, little twisty turn. Bam, like that. Yeah, that looks better. So, and then we can put, like, fences right there and right there and then right there. Yeah, that's, like, a nice bit of detail just to have. We're going, we're kind of leaning over the edge to the more fantasy style. Like I said, I wanted to keep it real. But up on the, up on the mountains and, like, that wizard tower. Well, it's not really a wizard tower. It's going to be, like, the king's bedroom. But it looks like a wizard tower. So I'm just going to call it the wizard tower. It's not really the wizard tower, but... Over on this mountain, you wouldn't really see that in real life. So, it's we're kind of heading over to the fantasy side, but I I'm fine with it. It's a good good change bone, good change bone. Yeah, that's a thing. Whatever. Um, these need to beat it because this is my roof. No one trifles with my roof. Um, can I do something here? What about a slab? Yeah, that's fine. Um, what does that look like on the inside? Let's just put one right there. Yeah, that's fine. And then, um, yeah, it pretty much looks the same from down here still. This, the, uh, lighting is really good because you can get these sh nice, sh I'm stuck on a freaking chimney cobweb. Um, you can get some nice, t uh, tone changes and it looks really cool. Um, let me just go ahead and show you what I mean. Like, smooth lighting off? Like, look how crapalicious that looks but when you turn it on by the way let me turn on fancy graphics because i'm so fancy what am i looking for um smooth lighting right um turn it on much much better um so i'm gonna go ahead and mirror this roof to the other side and i'll see you guys and you guessed it in a second Monday. so we've kind of got a problem here that i didn't quite think about but we've got just like this flat roof up here. And let me show you what I mean. If I uh, close it all in, then we get just this like flat thing. And that's no fun. So I think what I'm going to do is just leave it be because we're going for the little experimental thing right here. And a flat roof in medieval times, even though it was not something seen a whole lot is gonna be just fine or maybe we can have like a courtyard in the middle of the house or something but yeah that'll be really cool and um i th i'm kind of just super tired so this video might not go out tomorrow which will be which is a saturday um might go out on a different day but i'm just so tired that i don't even want to stand anymore um so I'm just going to go ahead and end the video right here. You will see some time lapses after this, but it uh, won't be live, obviously. So I just want to see what this looks like just for purposes. And it looks pretty freaking awesome. So um, I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Give it a like if you did and subscribe if you haven't already for more. And I have been Ace Games, and I'll see you guys in the next episode.